She's dead. Why didn't he strip her of her meat? I think he did Ro before. Because Roman wasn't hungry. Or maybe the pork was bad. That's... That's a shame. Or the other white meat. Baby! The other, <laughs> other white meat! <laughs> See, she's smiling! Yes. Oh jeez! Oh, 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 I must fuck you now. I need to use my hands. Wait a minute, he's killed almost the entire world. <laughs> oh, jeez. Fucking pervert. <laughs> well, I'm just going with what off you said. <laughs> you made me pause the film. Are you happy? I like how little Johnny's first sentiments after she, he's dead is she says, jeez, I wish I played house with her more. You can still play house. You can play, you can play Jeffrey Dahmer's house. <laughs> Roman Polanski's house. No, sorry. Roman Polanski's uh, house. Well, he's in pretty good shape for being thrown off that clam. Supposedly. And wait Charles. for it. Wait for it. Oh, oh no, how fucking cliche is that? <laughs> yeah, scream. Scream some more. Cause you're doing nothing else. I mean, did she just scratch her butt? I swear, she just scratched her butt. She was bored. <laughs> Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet? Yes. 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 Stop asking. Oh, hey, where'd the bubble machine go? Oh, they had to turn it off. I must have ran out of bubbles. The neighbors were complaining. Oh, who neighbors? Now, the, now he wants to be fucking human. <laughs> that was a drastic change of. Personality. I think he is doing this for the sole purpose of intercourse, though. So his oh. so his intentions are quite noble. I, oh, this no, is so risque for 1953. Next, we're gonna see an ankle. Oh my God, scandalous! I'm gonna tie you with this very thin rope. Oh darn! Okay, the bunny goes through the loop into the hole. And down. <laughs> Boy, he just punched her right in the eye there, didn't he? <laughs> Screw it. <laughs> Why do you call me at this time? I'm busy. I'm too busy. Peen. Come and get us. You can wait. Come and get us. I'm acting. Wait. He didn't have time to tie her up. He knocked her out. Wait, how come she's awake again? Ah, oh, god damn it! What oh, here comes the Greater Guidance! Happened? I'm busy, Greater Guidance! But now... <sighs> Great Guidance, stop calling me. I'm trying to fuck this woman. <laughs> I'm trying to fuck this woman, you cock block. <laughs> Grade A writing right there. I reject this movie, thank you very much. I reject your reality. I reject your reality and replace it with my own. Substitute. So we're now worshipping at the church and flying spaghetti monster then? Hooray! Alright! Woohoo! Spaghetti sauce bro! It's the only religion that makes sense. Yes, I must. Oh, shut the fuck up. Okay, don't try to have a personality now. No, he it's wants to be human. The gorilla wants to be human. Yeah, he just decides this out of the fucking blue. You know what would make this worse if he started singing musical style? <laughs> <laughs> that would be funny. Oh. <laughs> if I could just stay up there in the sun, wish I could be. Part of a human. The Bobsy Twins! <laughs> yeah, this is a kid's dream. 
and he dreamed that his sister was dead. That's a pretty messed up child. I don't care. He was an, he was an ugly porker anyway. Porky was much porkier. I cannot kill the girl, but I will kill the boy. Because killing men is so much easier than killing a woman man for the romance. And the romance. Maybe he likes guys, I don't know. Well, he said he would kill the boy. <laughs> Thank you, Ventura. Academy Award winning composer, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, he's got the Tor Johnson touch of doom. You can die in a human. Wait, what? Ah! Why did he do that? He killed the boy. Oh, oh, I'm acting. Help me. What? Why did he do that? He just killed the boy. I'm a release of did he say cosmic jewels? Oh, here comes the dinosaurs again! That was an armadillo with a bunch of horns taped to him. Yeah, it was. That was an armadillo. Great, not only, are they crappy, not only are they crappy filmmakers, they're cool to animals too, that's nice. Animals were harmed in the making of this film. That really, and we don't care. That really got some really shitty because stock footage. We're just in it for the money. No, that's the time it was so. <laughs> Wait a minute, did he resurrect the dinosaurs or something? And now he's back with the no, monitor no, looking at that crocodile. Hell, it's even the same shit from the beginning of the film. It makes and that crocodile has a taped fin and whatnot. Yeah, that is a croc. What a croc that croc is! Ah, 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 ah. Yeah, that is clearly like an alligator oh, or a crocodile God. with something on its fucking back. Oh, I'm personally thinking they got some really crappy stock footage. That's nice. Oh, that's that's the death ray. Right? That's not stock footage. That's a crock with some sort of thing taped to its back. Fin. I, I, I call dibs on the crock when it... I had this incredible dream! And you were in it! And you were in it! And you were there! And you died! <laughs> Big sex was in it, and she was having hot sex with the scientist. And that was like a willow with a scuba head on his head. And Porky over there was dead, which was the greatest thing ever. Or is it? So he apparently dreamed the whole thing. What a jip. Second worst movie cliche of all time. Any movie that ends with it was all a dream. Followed by the first worst. The Jesus. worst of all time. Or was it? Oh, God. This movie sucks. Actually, that's not the whole thing. That's, that's the greater guidance. I mean, yeah, that was, yeah, that's the greater Wait. guidance. Now At he's, least I can tell that the helmet's a little different. Yep. Now he's coming towards us again. And, and again! <laughs> Just to menacingly approach man. someone! End this fucking movie! Just stop! Just stop! My Why movie. won't you end? Oh. <laughs> One more time for the fans. I hate you. Well, we're done. Uh, All right, folks. Mercifully, we're oh, mercifully <laughs> that's over. That was pretty bad. Um, what a fucking horrible picture. So, uh, what do you guys think of Robot Monster? The plot was. Obviously, a Cold War, you know, propaganda film. Propaganda yes, film, yes. but it was one of the worst propaganda films I've ever seen. It's right up there with Reefer Madness. Nick, what are your thoughts? <laughs> Tony? This movie is quite possibly one of the worst ever made. But not At no worst. point in its entire rambling did it come up with anything resembling a plot or anything worthwhile of entertainment. 
I awarded no points, and may God have mercy on the soul on the assholes who made it. Nick, are you still gathering your thoughts? This could take a few years. He's lost for words, folks. Bob? <laughs> well... What's there to say that says the two worst movie cliches of all time? And what are those cliches, Bob? The first being the entire film you see is just a dream. And then, or was it? Dun, dun, dun. No, this movie it? makes less sense than, uh, than Plan 9 from Outer Space. And that's saying a lot. <laughs> yeah, that actually had, some, that had a plot to it. This... I this is all like over the fucking place! This... It's a Cold War propaganda Ooh. film! You have robots and gorilla suits! You have more stock footage than Ed Wood has in a wet dream! And you had a guy holding up an airplane and you could see his hand! Yeah! They couldn't afford a string! There's my review! They couldn't afford a <laughs> string! Pull the string! Pull it! Well... Next up, the, the Trek of the Moon Beast.